Okay, it's about 5.35. I believe that I am live, I'm not sure. Um, oh, it tells me not to rotate, so I'm not going to rotate. Uh, we're doing a yoga lattes class today, and um, if you're out there and you can chime in, that would be great so that I know that this is working. Um, so this is a mini yoga lattes class that we're going to be doing, and I say mini, it's going to be about 30 minutes, um, and which is usually half of what the normal session would be um but we're going to get our stretch and our flex and our balance in and um i'm not sure if this is actually something like uh it works on the regular uh facebook live that people can chime in it happened the other day and i think i might have actually done it on my personal page which wasn't the intention um, so now we're here at, uh, the Mimi for me yoga page. And so I hope it's working, um, because I, I don't think there's any interaction that can happen if there is, and there's anyone out there that can confirm that that would be awesome. Let me see. There's a bunch of buttons here. I'm not sure which one write a comment so I can make a comment. Anyway, it says live, so I'm gonna go with live. Mm. All right, everybody, whoever's out there, maybe nobody is, I don't know. But um, we're here at Mimi For Me Yoga Studio. We're going to continue with these free mini sessions of yoga and Pilates and um, meditation and all this good stuff. Um, I'm gonna be doing for kids, as much as for adults, as much as for seniors. So really it's for everyone. And um, here at the studio, the last thing we did before this virus, you know, enveloped the whole world um, was a yoga class. So we even took care of our little four-legged um, family members. So hopefully we'll get back to that sooner rather than later, but we will get back to that for sure. Um, all right, so let's begin. I'm going to turn on the music. For those that um, normally take my classes, um, you know what's coming. It's all good. For those that have never, which I'm going to venture to say is going to be a few of you. Oh my God, how come? Oh, there is somebody. Spiros is watching. Okay, cool. Hi, Spiros Tikanis. <laughs> I'm glad somebody showed up. All right, so now I see that there there can be, um, well, I don't know if it's interaction, but it just shows who's come on. Um, so we're going to begin. Yoga Lattes, it's a combination of yoga, combination of Pilates mixed in, and um, we'll start with breathing. We start, we interlace the breathing, and of course we finish with breathing, and I'm talking about conscious breathing, okay? Because we breathe all the time, but this is conscious uh, breath. So here we go. Palms out to the universe. We are not scared. We will manage, we will handle, and we will come out on the other side of this better for it smarter, wiser, and stronger. So that's why we're here to continue working on what we're supposed to be working on, no matter what, right? No matter what, we can, we still have that ability to take care of ourselves in order to take care of the rest. Okay, um, all right. So here we go. Oh, let me put the music on. Bear with me. Okay, so here we go. All right, I see some, it, it does show that some people are showing up, um, though it may not have the ability to make comments like we did the other day, but no worries, that's fine. I'm just going with it. Um, and it's a little disconcerting because those of us that have never done this before, um, it's very strange to talk into a camera versus, you know, 25 people, 15 people. So, namaste, here we go. Palms out to the universe. Let's take a deep breath. 
and exhale slowly. You can inhale through your nose and exhale out your nose, or inhale through your nose and exhale out your mouth. If you're gonna do that, make sure that there's no one around you. There should be anyone around you, right? They talk about six feet. So here we go, inhale. And exhale. One more time, inhale. And exhale. Let's begin with the hands on our hips. We'll go forward and side, back, side, all the way around. So draw that belly button in, making sure that you're always keeping your core in play. So that along with the breath, inhale. And we'll go once more, all the way around. We'll take it and we'll stop in the forward position, come back to center, lift the spine way nice and tall. Let's take it in the other direction, go forward, side, back, side. Keep breathing. I'm going to get closer to the camera to see who's there and who's talking. Finally, I get people talking, interacting with me. So let's go a couple more times while I come forward. Oh, David, thank you, my love. I know David since I was 12. Thank you. Justine, oh, my love, Justina in the house. Okay, cool. I'm glad we got some people there. All right, so we're going to meet in the forward position. Come back to center on top of the hips and lift that spine nice and tall. Take a deep breath. Inhale the arms up. And let's just reach through the side body. Inhale and exhale. So remember, I'm doing this for you, for me, and for anyone that I've not even ever met, or, or for those that have never taken a class with me. This is an opportunity for us to connect. So, you know, social distancing and all that, but uh, we don't need to disconnect all together, right? All right, let's bring our hands way high, high towards the ceiling. We're pulling away from our hips and gently bring the spine down, down, down. So we're stretching the spine, right? Creating space between each disc and then we're realigning the spine on the way down. So let's try that again two more times. Inhale up, nice and tall. Exhale, take it down. Inhale up and exhale, take it down. Let's bring those arms and just through Imagine that you're going through water, so there's some resistance going on here. Inhale. I think the music is a little loud, so I'm going to turn it down just a little bit. Keep moving those arms. Resist. Like you're bringing those arms through water, right? Okay, I hope that's better. All right, and then we're going to meet at heart center. <sighs> Beautiful. Okay, so we're going to stretch out the legs, and I hope that um, that you got your mat out. Okay, again, this is a mini class, so we've got about you know 30 minutes here. So be comfortable. You're on the floor, and um, I did a chair yoga as the first one, and uh, you know <laughs> we're winging it. I'm doing what I know, but all that technology, I'm not too sure of, so hopefully it'll get better in the days to come, okay? In the meantime, you're stretching out your legs, and let's bring that right leg, I believe it's on the right side for you as well, okay? So, there we go, we're going to hook the left elbow right on the shin, underneath the knee, never touch the knees. Okay, lift up, and stretch out that right arm, and go ahead and turn the arm. I don't know if you can see that. You're turning the arm inward, bending at the elbow, and just placing it on that left hip. Then we're going to lift up, take a deep breath, inhale. As we turn, we exhale out. Inhale, and we unravel the spine. Take it to the other side, a counter stretch. Center. 
we're going to take our hands to our ankle or to our shins or calves or even just behind the knee and bringing the knee up to the chest. But whatever works for you, whatever stretch your body's asking for, that's where you go, okay? And then we're going to let go of one hand and the other, and we're going to gently bring the leg down as we gently stretch, 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 stretch. Oh, more people are showing up. That's great. You know, we're going to get better at not being late for class, by the way. <laughs> Let's go ahead and move some energy around, right? So sweep up the legs, inhale up to the universe, exhale, release. Inhale up, exhale, release. Let's go two more times. Inhale, stretch the spine. Exhale, release all the muscles in the back. And one more time. Inhale up. Exhale, release. And just wherever you land, land and relax. Take a deep breath here. Inhale. I'm going to take a look. Exhale. Wonderful. All right. And then we're going to meet at heart center. Let's take it to the other side, right? So make sure that you feel comfortable doing that. Make sure that you're anchoring the foot on the floor and take the right elbow and hook it right underneath the, the knee there. Okay, so nice. We're going to lift up as we inhale and we turn. Exhale. So what you're doing here in essence is you're getting a nice stretch on your um, on your hips certainly but going into your quad into your uh, hamstring so that's always nice all right we're going to go ahead and exhale as we come back and just take it into a counter stretch inhale and unravel the spine back to center find your hands on your ankle or your calf or behind your knees whatever works for you whatever feels right okay you never do anything that doesn't feel right for your body, okay? Your body will let you know. So inhale, let go of one, exhale, release the other, and then gently bring it down, down as your spine lifts up, 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 up. Take a deep breath, exhale, release all the muscles. So it's a full surrender. Inhale, and exhale, we're going to go three sweeps. Inhale up, exhale, release. Inhale up, exhale, release, and once more, inhale up, and exhale, release. We're going to meet at heart center. <sighs> okay, so we're going to take the bottom of our feet together. We call it bow. That's what I'm going to go ahead and just, you know, find the butterfly wings. So we're opening up now the hips even more so, getting into the groin and the inner thighs, your adductors. So go ahead and, you know, flap your butterfly wings. Breathe. And exhale. Hey, Kathleen, my darling. I need you here for some kick-ass kickboxing. That's Kathleen there. If anybody sees it, I don't even know if you can see each other. But Kathleen, I'm serious. I want to do some kickboxing. All right, so here we are, and we release. Okay, if it feels comfortable, just uh, bring your hands to the front of your ankles, elbows, not the bony part, but more like into the forearm. Take it and bring it onto your inner thighs. As you hinge forward, think about protruding your chest forward rather than, you know, rounding it back, okay? So you're going to hinge forward, and you're going to press down, use your arms, the strength of your arms to give yourself a nice stretch through your uh, hips and, um, and your groin and your inner thighs, which we just kind of moved around enough so that they're a little bit warmed up. Okay, so now they're ready for a stretch. Stretch them out, inhale, and go forward. Forward, forward, forward. And you go as forward as you feel comfortable, okay? Never overdo it. You know, certainly you're not gonna get a cookie from me now. In my class, you don't get cookies either. <laughs> so it's always about what you feel works for your body. And we're going to drop the neck and the head, scoop out the belly and round the spine all the way up. We're gonna do that once more. Inhale, take it forward. Press down into your inner thighs. And then release the neck and the head and scoop and round it all the way up. It's all really delicious. <laughs> okay, so 
your legs out. So remember, we're doing a yoga lattes. So we're going to take it back. We're going to start working the lattes or the pilates part of it is working your core, which of course supports your back and it's all good. So we're gonna scoot down. And I hope you can see most of this. I'm looking in the camera and I can see myself. So I think you could probably as well. If you can, please let me know something. Um, but here we go. So hands are going to be behind the knees. We're gonna scoop out the belly and round the spine. And then we're going to gently bring our spine onto the floor, one vertebra at a time. And wonderful. So the knees are going to draw towards the chest and we're going to imprint the lower back. Okay, as we imprint the lower back onto the floor, we're going to hopefully feel a little massage of the lower back as we go side to side. Wonderful. So it's imprinting just like we would imprint, um, you know, the thumb on an ink pad. Okay, so we're going to stretch out the left leg and the right leg goes up we come up okay and we call the scissors so the idea is that you're going to keep your torso as steady as possible as you move your legs so inhale and exhale the other leg comes up inhale exhale inhale pilates requires a stronger breath because you're using a stronger part of your body. So again, whatever works for you. Inhale, exhale, and gently bring the knees to the chest as you relax. So head down on the floor, the back of the head is on the mat, and gently bring the head side to side. Again, you know, it says every time I move the camera, it says that um, I shouldn't, so I'm not. Um, but I hope you can see me, okay. So the knees to the chest, and take a breath. Beautiful, okay. Hands are going to anchor onto the floor, right? The fingertips are gonna anchor onto the floor for a little support, and we're going to bring the legs up to the sky. Beautiful, so with a strong, energized both legs, um, we're going to take them out to the side, like the letter V in victory. We're going to drop them towards the earth, Bring them together, squeeze so it's as if you're zipping up your inner thighs, squeeze all the way to your tush, and gently bring it back up to the sky. Flex the feet, bring the heels down towards the floor, point, gently bring it up. And yeah, so this is some um, super duper for your six pack. <laughs> so keep breathing. And we'll go one more. Point up, flex it down, and point up, and we stay. And we're gonna go back to what we did initially, which is bring the legs out, like the letter V, drop them down towards the ground, bring the legs together, and bring them all the way up to the sky. Again, out, drop, together, and all the way up to the sky. One more time, out, down, together, and all the way up. Bend the knees and take a break. <sighs> Imprinting the lower back to the mat. Okay, beautiful. So we're going to rock. Tuck your chin into your collarbone and rock. You're rounding out your spine as well. Okay, so rock. And rock. And when you're ready, you're going to cross at the ankles and you're going to sit. You gotta just, I don't know, I have to figure this out. If anyone's a videographer out there or just wants to come and video, <laughs> let me know. Because I think, I don't know, I think I need another person or I need a tripod here, there, and everywhere. I don't know. Because it's just that little part and it's really hard to be able to capture all this on the camera. But I will figure it out again. It's only been a few days, right? Okay, so legs are crossed, hands always nice and wide with those fingers when we have them on the floor. So here we go. We step back, step back, and we call this downward facing dog. Okay, so your heels are really, really close to the ground. I don't know if you can see that. I can actually move over. No, that's worse. 
Okay. So down to the ground. So it's called Downward Facing Dog for those that don't know. And it's quite delicious. It's a great back body stretch. And what we're trying to do here is Again, nothing is perfect ever. You know, every day is gonna be different. You wake up with a different body every day. But your heels are drawing towards the ground. Your hips towards the sky and your chest towards the front of your thighs, your quads. And that's it. And we take one more breath here, inhale. Exhale, we look at our hands and we'll move forward into plank position, okay? Plank position and when we go into plank, what you want to do is you want to um, really just hug your rib cage with the muscles in your core. And then you want to squeeze that touch just a little bit. All right, so we're going to stay there for a few breaths. So, inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. I'm moving back just so you guys can see. Okay, and last one. And then when we're ready, we're gonna take it down and open up. I don't, I think I lost you guys. <laughs> I definitely lost you guys. And bring it back into child's pose. All right, so I definitely have to figure it out now. It seems like I have to be straight in front of the camera to do this. So um, we'll continue in front of the camera <laughs> with poses in front of the camera so taking it to uh, the saw first of all we're going to take the pillows these are the pillows out of the way so that we're really connecting with the earth through our tailbone okay and we're flexing our feet you know toes up and when we're ready arms go out again pulling up away from the hips we're going to turn the pinky is going to open up. I don't know if you can see that. Okay, open up, and we're going to saw. Okay, <laughs> saw the pinky off. So here we go. Inhale, turn and saw, saw. Come back to center. Inhale up. Exhale, saw, saw. Inhale up. Exhale, exhale, and breathe. Inhale. Inhale. Inhale, we'll go one more time. And really go beyond your foot, okay? As you twist and you go beyond, beyond your foot, come back to center. So working all through the core, this is Pilates, people. Okay, and inhale, back to center. Lift up and reach up. And when you're ready, exhale and just surrender to the earth and relax. So I hope that those that are on here are actually doing this with me and not just watching, okay? Um, I'm offering this so that we can get our stretch and our flex and, and just keep going, you know, um, until things stabilize just a little bit better, right? So uh, always take care of you, first and foremost, me time, because without it, you know, you're not putting on that oxygen mask and without that oxygen mask on first can't take care of anybody else all right one more breath here and exhale come back to center okay so beautiful we're gonna cross um i'm gonna have to end this only because i have to figure out a better way to um have a camera be able to capture everything because I see station you know keeping the camera stationary like that isn't gonna really work not on a live um, feed like we're, we've got going on right now so this was good I hope that you got something out of it it was a mini session and um, I will get better at this um, in terms of the technology okay so inhale up and exhale. Let's do two more of those as I lower the music. Yeah. All right, you guys. So, heart center. We finish by acknowledging 
that this body, this breath, and this spirit of ours is a gift. And so we come to honor that gift anytime we come to practice. So we have now worked on our physical body. We never ever, and now more than ever, forget to work on our emotional body. It is the gasoline that goes into the vehicle. So we inhale and we take in all the joy we deserve. We scoop out the belly and round the spine, and that's like giving someone a hug. It's a reminder to give back love, no matter how, where, but every day. Reach up and acknowledge everything you have. We still have a lot, so be grateful and give gratitude. And then we always take some quiet time for peace. So it's joy and love, gratitude and peace. For those that came on, thank you so much for joining. I really appreciate it. And um, I'll see you again in a few days. So stay tuned here. And um, I did another class the other day and I thought it was on here, but I have a feeling that it was on my personal page. I also did something on Instagram, but that kind of disappeared. I couldn't even upload that. So hopefully this will work. <laughs> I'm still working on it. Thank you everybody for coming on. Namaste. It means what's good in me, honors and respects what's good in you. Thank you. Be healthy, be happy, and live with ease. Namaste. Hey, Janet, you're back, love. You should back up more closer to the wall so we can see what you're doing better. My girlfriend always says it how it is. Janet in the house. Um, okay. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to see everyone that came on. Hey, Max, that would be Melissa. Um, but I'll Spiros. I hope you're enjoying Florida, love. Um... Diana Sophia, Diana, oh my gosh, Melissa, so happy, so happy you're all here, so beautiful, is that, oh, Melissa, mm -hmm. you know, uh, I feel the same about you, girl, all right, I'm gonna hopefully upload this, and um, stay connected, guys, because I'm gonna get better at this technology, okay, love you all, thanks, bye-bye.